we're very vehemently opposed on, on, on principle and on three grounds to them ripping out all the retail. A, uh, this is not another Paul Martin building where the city fought the federal government and the city called them a slum landlord. The city is responsible for fixing the parking garage and keeping the retail in place as opposed to turn it into a parking lot. It will affect the property values downtown. It will uh, create downtown to become much, much less of a pedestrian friendly area. We're trying to attract bodies to downtown, not cars. Cars don't make a great downtown. Bodies do, people do. And so we're doing exactly the opposite of council Monday night. We're gonna uh, ask that all the retail be taken out of this area of downtown. This would become, it would fester into a dead zone. It would destroy all the businesses and, and, and affect the property values of the residents all around it. It would create an area where violence could occur. You, if you've ever come here late at night after the bars close and hear the noise and and, and the, the screaming and the hollering and the drunkenness that goes on, it would just continue that throughout the whole area. Uh, what we need to do is fix up the shops, uh, whether it's a private developer that does it or the city or whoever wants to take on the task, and we need to repair them and have retail throughout the downtown. A walkable, pedestrian-friendly downtown like Ann Arbor, Toronto, Chicago, uh, everywhere that is successful has a very pedestrian-friendly, walkable downtown. We're not dependent on cars, we're dependent on people.